am excited to introduce you to our WineSaver Wine by the Glass systems, our truly affordable commercial system, WineSaver Pro, and our new home consumer system, WineSaver Home. Cheers! Please be certain to fill out your warranty card. The serial number is the five letter code on the back of the regulator and is also located on the outside of your Wine Saver Pro packaging. This is our Wine Saver Pro rack and bottle guard. This is our Wine Saver tap head assembly, stainless steel draw tubes, and Wine Saver Pro argon gas canisters. This is the tap head lever, the rubber draw tube seal, and the male side of our quick connect coupler. Now let's get started putting your Wine Saver Pro system together. Start by inserting about a quarter inch of the stainless steel draw tube into the rubber seal. Insert each tap head assembly into a fresh, full bottle of wine. Continue to do so for all five bottles. You'll notice I'm placing the larger Pinot Noir and Syrah bottles in the center of the Wine Saver Pro. The center slots will accommodate even the largest bodied wine bottles. Be certain to push the tap head down firmly into each bottle to ensure the best seal possible and to avoid any potential gas leakage. In the next frame, I'll show you how to connect the argon gas supply lines. Again, remember to push the tap head assembly into the bottle with force. Now you are ready to connect the argon gas supply lines. To connect the argon gas supply lines, first, depress the metal tab on the top of the quick connect coupler so that it is fully opened. Next. Slide the coupler over the male side of the tap head connection, making sure it is fully engaged. You will notice it will snap when fully secured. Hold the bottle securely and snap the quick connect coupler onto the tap head until it snaps into place. Installing Argon Gas Canisters Push in the right side of Wine Saver Pro gas panel door to open and expose the canister. To replace an empty canister, simply turn counterclockwise until free and discard in your steel recycling. A hole in the end of the canister will tell you that it's used and empty. This is what a new canister will look like. To install a new argon gas canister, thread the canister into the regulator inlet clockwise. You will turn about seven turns and then feel resistance. At this time, Grip canister tightly and continue threading, which will puncture the piercing mechanism and activate the canister. Continue until the canister is fully seated. Cleaning and maintenance are simple with Wine Saver Pro. 
First, always remove the gas supply line whenever removing a bottle from the rack. Remove the tap head assembly from the empty bottle and disconnect the draw tube from the tap head. Run very hot water. Ouch! Rinse the draw tube with very hot water. Next, depress the tap lever fully and again, run very hot water through the tap head and out the other side to flush any wine residue or sediment still in the tap head. This next step is the most important maintenance requirement and should be completed every time a bottle is changed. Let hot water run on the seal fins for 30 seconds to allow the fins to spring back to their original factory shape. It must be emphasized that this is a simple but essential step and it must be done every time a bottle is replaced. Reinstall the draw tube a quarter inch into the tap head, wiping off any excess water. Reinstall the tap head assembly into a fresh bottle of wine and your Wine Saver Pro system is ready to pour winery fresh wine.